I look like a freaking Oompa Loompa sheep wool fuck. That's what I look like. Hey guys, welcome back to my shitty ass sheep channel. I literally look like a fucking sheep or like a goat. So this is faux, by the way, this is real. I'm not an animal killer. Uh, I just eat them. It's about a special type of girl. We call her Carly Steele. So many people are gonna unsubscribe and be like, Carly, you're so mean. Trust me, if I was raised not eating meat, I would not eat meat. It's so hard to change something that you were raised on. Um, but I'm through the McDonald's drive-thru. Uh, today we have painters coming to paint, so I thought I would leave and like maybe do some shopping and stuff while they're painting, cause I don't wanna just be like standing there watching them paint, I think it's really fucking weird. Uh, we have to put the, the kids, which, are my three cats inside of a little room and I feel so bad it's only gonna be for an hour and a half I put like their litter in there their water and their food but I feel so bad because it's so little it's not like super little like it's the size of a room but there's a lot of things in that room that they're gonna have to like jump over and stuff but I don't know hopefully they will be fine Good morning, can I help you? Hi, may I have um, a number four with a hash brown? And okay, number four combo, what would you like to drink? A medium coffee, double double with an espresso shot. Okay, and what is it? anything else? No, that's all. Okay, so your total comes to $8.90 for a window. Thank you. I was a kid when I whenever I would like ask the teacher like can I go to the bathroom they'd be like I don't know can you <laughs> I, I can't I literally can't anyways I don't know what Connor is doing hopefully gone <laughs> fuck I can't wait to eat to be honest I literally look so insane but I'm so cold that I'm not fucking around and I'm sick and I'm really not trying to get like pneumonia or some shit and like be dead I'm too pretty to die. No, I'm just kidding. So this is day, <laughs> not even day. This is hour one of my diet and it has failed. I am in the McDonald's drive-thru and I am totally uh, shameful about it. My diet yesterday lasted until I basically dieted all day and then before I went to bed I was like, I'm starving, I can't go to bed on an empty stomach. And I'm getting surgery by the way, like another plastic surgery. So I was like, I'm just gonna eat, they're just gonna suck the fat out of me anyway. <laughs> so I ate a whole box of cookies, Funyuns, Flamin' Hot Funyuns, which by the way are so good, and then I also ate a big huge bag of chips and cheese, so. Hi. Hi. Hi, we on? Thank you, you too. I did not need to be so quiet. I was like, thank you, you too, but like my voice was like gone or something, or like I sounded depressed for a minute. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck just happened. She probably thought it was a bitch. Okay, I'm gonna park and then we're gonna do a little mukbang. Oh my. When you're so famous, the spotlight just follows you. <laughs> Fuck, I'm so funny. Love that for me. I'm like, I'm gonna pick some good lighting. Look at this fucking lighting. Oh, actually, no, it's good. Oh, okay. Love that for me. So I'm gonna take this off. Take my fucking huge ass goat jacket off. And we're gonna eat McDonald's together. hash brown and then two breakfast burritos I'm um, honestly I would get like seven <laughs> I could probably eat four breakfast burritos easily and two hash browns like not even gonna lie but I'm going out with my friend Caitlin today since I have to be gone for the paint I'm gonna be gone with uh, Caitlin probably shopping and stuff we're supposed to go to Detroit and go to Hobby Lobby but it seems like a lot of fucking work so I'm not gonna do that we're probably just gonna go shopping here. Maybe go to Goodwill and stuff. Um, 
and we're probably gonna go out to eat, so that's why I'm like, that's why I'm eating like a healthy, low calorie breakfast. <laughs> I eat fucking McDonald's. But I'm saying that's why I didn't order more than I would. I probably would have ordered like a fucking donut and like a bunch of, sh a bunch of shit, so. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I don't care what anybody says about McDonald's. Like, oh my god, it's so hot. There's obviously a reason why McDonald's is the number one fast food place in the fucking world. There's a reason. So, for all the people that say, McDonald's is so nasty. Like, their meat is so gross. Their breakfast, though, like, don't get me wrong. I'd rather have a burger from, like, Five Guys or something than McDonald's. But if I'm at McDonald's and that's the only thing around me, I'm going to eat it. Like, and I'm going to freaking like it, too. Like, don't at me. I'm just burning the shit out of my mouth today. I have a coffee with an espresso shot. I just flicked you guys off and I did not mean to. Let's see if... He's freaking blowing up my phone like usual. Did I lose my phone? Is that what just happened to me? <laughs> I'm trying to be a real mukbanger. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm on my phone. This freaking, I wish I, the steering wheel could like go away. <laughs> okay, move this out of the way. Oh, that's so much better. It's such a better angle, I feel like. Oh my gosh, I, I might go through the drive-thru and get more. <laughs> Have you guys ever done that? Cause I've done it many times. Is that Connor? Anyways, Connor's like in the drive-thru. <laughs> He's trying to say that it's not him, when I'm pretty sure I know. He just invited me to the movies, but I hate the movies, so. <laughs> Is that just me? I do not like the movies, like, at all. I'd rather be at home, in bed, with my old snack of choice, even a meal, like, bitch, or order pizza in my own bed, there's nothing better than that. I'm not going to go pay to go watch a movie in an uncomfortable seat. Actually, they're really comfortable now, but. And, like, if it's quiet the whole time, like, I don't know. I'd rather watch it at home. I low-key feel like Netflix and stuff is, like, killing the theater, but I don't know. A lot of people like to go still to, like, be, like do, like, the whole experience of it. I don't like it, but I think the only time I would like it if it's like a really, really like legendary movie. Justin Bieber, Never Say Never. <laughs> That's not a legendary movie, but like if a Titanic remake came out, I'd go watch it in the theater. It has to be a movie that I really, really want to see. Like I really want to see. I feel pretty. I feel pretty, so I went and saw that. Uh, I really wanted to see Fault in Our Stars when that came out, so I saw that. Mm. That's really it. I don't see a lot of movies in the theaters. The last movie I saw in a theater was I Feel Pretty. And that was a long time ago. I just realized the air's been on this whole time and you guys are probably so annoyed. I think I'm gonna go through the drive-thru again. <laughs> and get two more burritos. <laughs> yes, guys, I know I'm gaining weight. And this is why. It's so good, I really don't even give a fuck. <laughs> is that on my face? 
Oh, it's just ugliness. <laughs> no, but for real, what is that? It's so weird because it's not in the mirror. It's so weird. Connor just said he saw me, but I don't see him, so. I want to see if Connor actually sees me because if he does, I'm not going to go through the drive through again. <laughs> But if he's gone and he can't see me, I'm going again. I really want to go again. Carly's still going through the drive-thru for 10 minutes straight. I don't know why I want to do so many of those videos. Like, every one of my last videos, I've been wanting to title, like, Carly's still eating chips for 10 minutes straight. Carly's still doing this for 10 minutes straight. I just think it's so funny. I don't know why. The first 10 minute straight one I ever saw, I think, was Manny MUA copying his friends for 10 minutes straight or something. I don't know. Guys, I really need to make sure Connor's not here. Connor said he's here. I just really, really, I might, what if I go to a different McDonald's? <laughs> How extra would that be? I think that's called, like, an eating problem because... <laughs> I'm just like so freaking hungry. Like I want to eat another two. I don't want a hash brown. I just want a breakfast burrito. I'm like fat, but like I'm not like that fat. <laughs> Literally every time I say something, I try to justify it in my head. Like Carly, don't worry. You can have two burritos. Like you're a skinny queen. And then the other half of me is like, Carly, that's so fucking bad for you. Stop overeating. You're full. Fine. You're bi. Like you're good. And the other half of me is like, yeah, but it's so good. And like, why not? Uh, I'm waiting for Caitlin to wake up. <laughs> I don't know if she ever will. You guys obviously know Caitlin. It takes Caitlin literally like fucking. She will sleep for 14 hours. Like 14. If she goes to sleep at 10, I know she's not waking up till like 12 or 1. Like I know it. I just expect it. This coffee's kind of fucking nasty. The one at home that I make is so much better. The one you guys saw me make a couple days ago where I put like the espresso and then the cream and then my coffee just tastes so much better. This tastes like, like you know when coffee grounds are too sh strong? I know a lot of people like McDonald's coffee because it's stronger than Tim Hortons, but it almost tastes burnt. Like to me, it tastes like burnt popcorn. But why does my ear look so big? Did my ears grow overnight? I want to go to Caitlin's and just sleep with her because I moved in the mattress off of the floor um, and like leaned it against my dresser so that they have more room to paint. So now I have nowhere to sleep and like 90% of the time I have a nap throughout the day. Now I can't have my nap and now I'm really upset. So is it bad that I'm like thinking of getting a freaking hotel just to go and like have somewhere to lay the fuck down? And they're not even like Oh, by the way, they're not coming till 1 now. So I woke up at 7.30 to get everything ready for them by 9. And they're not coming till 1. That was my fault, though, because I asked them to um, come at 11. And now they can't come till 1. So that was my fault. But oh, my gosh, it's so weird. I just went on instagram and the first thing that came up was a like a quote picture and it says i wish i could push through workout i wish i could push through a workout as well as i can push through a meal when i'm clearly full which is literally me because i want to go back through the drive through but to be honest i don't feel full the heck this guy that's verified literally just said let me speak to you real quick so i was like oh what's up like thinking it was gonna be like business he sent me like two messages saying he wants to like work together because my music's really cool well I opened it but I didn't answer because I was too busy like moving stuff in my apartment well he just unsent them and then resent a picture of me with hard eyes so instead of like he literally unsent the messages as if like I never saw it but it's so it shows that I saw it so now he just looks stupid the only time I unsend things is if like I know that the person hasn't seen it yet and like or like I made um, a spelling error. That's the only time I do it. Like, why are you sending things that you should have to unsend anyways? That just doesn't make sense. <clears throat> I feel like nowadays it's so hard to, like, trust people because, first of all, I'm going fucking bald right there. Do you guys see that? 
um it's so hard to trust people with all the freaking technology like instagram you can unsend now snapchat just goes away they hid the freaking best friend feature it used to be public like you used to be able to see who somebody's best friend was and now you can't see it anymore so i think i might go home and put the mattress on the floor and sleep because i'm tired and i'm grumpy because i'm tired and i'm gonna start my period in like two days and i feel like shit so yeah or i might just go to my mom's and sleep there i don't know it's so hot i'm literally picking my belly button ring in front of you right after i just ate that's awesome so i'm gonna go to my mom's and have a nap so i will see you guys later i love you guys so so much if you guys are new don't forget to subscribe and give this a thumbs up and stay confident bye guys can i have two breakfast burritos sorry i literally look like they're probably like wow this girl took off her jacket to be like a different person but we know it's her Hi. Hi. Well, that's not mine. <laughs> I wish it was mine. I wish I got two coffees instead of two extra breakfast burritos and I wasn't freaking obese. I'm literally so embarrassed, but I don't care. How do they know it's for me? They don't. Guys, I gotta poop so bad. Every time I have coffee, oh. Okay, thank you. Okay. <clears throat> the good thing about eating a big breakfast is I don't usually eat until like dinner. So then I can get more things done throughout the day. <laughs> I love my excuse again. Um, if you... So that's a good thing. I'm making an excuse for myself. These are small, mind you. Like, if you get a burrito from Chipotle, it's literally, like, f all four of these put together, okay? Plus, you get, like, a drink, and sometimes you get chips. Okay, I'm just trying to justify myself here. I don't do this every day, by the way. Yesterday, I literally just had two hard-boiled eggs and a slice of turkey bacon. You guys saw it. I don't know if I posted that, actually, yet. Oh. <sighs> so hot I don't know if I'm gonna eat both of them I'll probably just eat one watch me eat both oh my god I can't believe I literally closed this video and everything just to go through it again so yeah for the plastic surgery by the way I'll make a video on what I'm getting. I know there's going to be a bunch of hate comments. This gives me deja vu because right before my other surgery, I ate breakfast burritos. And I did a mukbang on it, but I don't think I uploaded it. Yeah, I don't think I did. I don't remember. Anyways, my plastic surgery is in a month. Um, I know I'm going to get a bunch of controversial people again. Mm. In my video, I'll explain everything though. And you guys might understand a little bit more. This is like actually a deformity that I have. But you guys can't see it because it's always hidden. I'll explain it in the video. I mean, I'm not that insecure about it. And I really wouldn't get a surgery on it, but I'm like, why not? I'm working with the surgeon to promote him, so I'm like, okay, I'll take it. Like, you know. We're going to Starbucks. I'm going to get an ice water. This is on the way to my mom's, and I'm so thirsty right now. It's like driving me crazy. <clears throat> when I go out to eat, if I get beer, like at dinner, I always get a water with it. Like if I get an alcoholic drink. And then in the morning, I always get water 
with my coffee because nothing quenches your thirst like water does like you can drink juice you can i mean juice kind of quenches my thirst but coffee and like beer and stuff which i heard they're both diuretic so i don't know i mean i know alcohol definitely dehydrates you but as for coffee i don't know if that's like a true thing or not i was doing some research on it and like i don't think it was proven that it like it, it makes you pee more but it doesn't show that it makes you any less hydrated than like it says you had to drink a lot of it but i don't know <clears throat> one thing i love about getting surgery by the way is the iv most people hate the iv i love the iv because i feel so hydrated and so good like if i could have an iv drip in me every night i would totally do that it feels so good guys i said i wasn't gonna eat the second one and i am should i go through starbucks or should i just go home well not home but to my mom's I feel like I should just go to my mom's, but I'm so thirsty right now. Her house is literally like three minutes away from Starbucks. But there's something about Starbucks water, I swear. Our gas here is really cheap right now. So we go by liters, not gallons. And it's like 90, 93 cents right now, which is crazy. It's usually like a dollar twenty-eight, a dollar thirteen. Never mind, it's a dollar oh one right now. Yesterday, at least, no, yeah, yesterday, it was like ninety-four cents or something, ninety something cents, which is crazy. Our gas in Canada is really expensive. We also get taxed on our gas. Which in America you don't. I'm so full. I could probably just eat one of these and be full, but I have to eat four. so bad good morning welcome to Starbucks Talk to you today. is it possible that I could just get an ice water sure drive it up thank you I'm so fucking thirsty. Thank you so You're much. Have a good one. You too. I needed water. I think it's really nice. And she gave me a venti. Usually they give you a grande. Oh my gosh. I swear. I don't always do this, by the way. I think it's really, I don't think it's rude, but I mean, it's just water. But I feel bad for like the workers that have to like just. I mean, I don't know. I don't know why it makes me feel bad. But I'm always at Starbucks. 
but the fact that you know you can get water if you go to Starbucks. Who is that? Hello? Okay, so. Oh, it's so good. I'm probably not gonna eat till like freaking four now because I'm so full. And it is so not good. house too so as you guys remember me and Caitlin are supposed to do stuff today um, I'm right near Caitlin's house like literally literally like three streets away because my mom was always lived in this neighborhood which is where I grew up around which is why Caitlin lives here because we went to the same school lived in the same neighborhood so When I was a kid, oh gosh. When I was a kid, I felt like her house was so far. Like I was like, oh my gosh, like she lives so far. But like now that I drive, I'm like, it's literally three streets away. I mean, it was like three long blocks and you had to walk down like two blocks that way. So it was like a total like flat five blocks. But like when you're a kid, that's like a lot. Like that's like half, like that's the other side of the fucking city. But now that I'm an adult, I'm like, I can literally walk there in like five minutes, like. Eating, so overeating and then going to sleep and then getting a free Starbucks water, <laughs> my favorite thing to do. Okay, I don't think anyone's home, so that means I could totally sleep. That's totally great. Connor's at home right now because they're not coming till one, so he is watching the cats. And then I think we're gonna go to a movie. I don't really wanna go, but I'll go. I'm not gonna make him go by himself, so. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Don't overeat, don't do what I did. I love you guys so much, and stay confident. Bye, beautifuls. Could that bikini with the brown hair? I love it when she comes around here. Damn, tell me when you come to town. We can wear them headphones, baby, no sound. Damn, what up, Carly? What's up, girl? Tell me what I gotta do to make you my girl. Huh, with that Louis Vuitton. I can see you at the it kind.